Yeah, 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 this your boy Drummer, man. You already know what's happening. D Boy Fresh, Drum Squad. You watching Hip Hop Wire. You already know what time it is. M Town, A Town. Hey, yeah, boy. Okay, cool. Being from Memphis, this is a big country western town. Mm -hmm. And nobody can really, those who really know, you can't put you on the box as a hip hop producer. Are we gonna see any, any beats like that going towards some golf books or going towards some pop 40 talks? I mean, really, damn. Man, like we already got scheduling for Nashville working on country. We got a lot of country writers who've been reaching out, you know what I'm saying, want me to be a part of the project. So, like I said, man, you just gotta stay tuned. Like, I know I gotta tell you a little something. I know y'all wanna know what's going on with me, but man, just hang tight, you know what I mean? Like, we take a flight, and we definitely love country music, you know what I'm saying? And I got Buku formats already laid out for a couple songs and ideas that we're about to, to make moves on and start shopping, so stay tuned, man. It's gonna be, it's gonna be great. You got any endorsement deals, anything like that you want to speak on? That um, no, we know we we working on a couple of things. You know what I mean? It's been a couple of uh people shoot uh shouting out. You know what I mean? I can't say any names because it's not 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 done deal yet. But we got a couple of things we putting together, man. On the on the video game side, on the on the uh keyboard side, as well as uh the sound side. You know what I'm saying? So stay tuned. All right, man. Go. <laughs> For um for a lot of the kids, man, that's trying to get into the game and trying to find their way in this music business, man, can you have any advice, you know, kind of lay out your hustle, you know what I'm saying, so maybe somebody else could come man, follow in your footsteps? Advice to the kids, man, learn, you know what I mean, like, knowledge is power, you know what I mean, like, anytime you can know what you're talking about, anytime that you can know what you're doing before you're doing it. Nine times out of ten, you're going to be effective doing it. It's a lot of people who try things and they fail and get discouraged. Or it's a lot of people who look at what I do and think it's real easy and just try to do it. Like the first thing you need to do is just lock yourself in a room for a month and just like jump into the pool. Get yourself wet. It's like jumping into a whole new world. So you have to like jump in. You can't just sit on the side of the pool and dangle your feet in it. You know what I mean? It ain't no... Let me jump on this side of the fence and do that. Like, you know what I mean? That's why I said school was, for me, kind of a distraction. And I had to, like, go against the grain because my parents wanted me to stay in school. You know what I mean? And my whole family, my whole background, you know, PhDs and master degrees and whatnot. So the pressure was on me to stay in school, but I had to follow my heart. And I've seen some people who, well, no, nah, I'm just finish school for my parents. Like, I didn't want to be the story. I did it for my parents. You know what I'm saying? And I had to show them that I was ready to take the world by storm myself, individually. You know what I'm saying? Moved to Atlanta, successfully did everything that they said I couldn't do. And, you know, now they, they all behind me. They all for it because it's like you, you've shown and you've escalated past that. So, I mean, to say any motivation to anybody coming up is, you know what I mean? Follow your dream, man. You know what I mean? Like, if you know you can do it, just show somebody, just prove to them, you know what I mean? Because the proof is in the pudding, you know what I mean? And that's why y'all love me. It's a lot of people who see me and, and be like, man, that's a success story come true. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm doing what I love and I'm being successful doing it. You know what I mean? That's what successful is about. Not how about how rich you get, how much money you got, how much diamonds. You know what I mean? Like, you don't need none of that. As long as you're doing, able to wake up, you ain't got no wrinkles on your forehead. You waking up every day doing whatever you want to do. And you going wherever you want to go. Because of the situation that you put in yourself, you know what I mean? The place that you put yourself. You know what I mean? So that's just what you gotta do, man. That's 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 happy world and happy living for me. You um you just spoke on, you know, what a success is. Tell the people, you know, if 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 possible, if if you can, what's your biggest failure? What's what's something that you said, man, you know, this didn't really work out, but at the end of the day you just kept going. Man, let me see. Something didn't work out. I mean, I have to say, I don't know. I mean, a failure to me is like, you know, when the unexpected happens or like when you think ten or 15000 is about to come through where you can pay all your bills and pay all your, you know what I'm saying, everything that you got in line and then it don't come through. So you like, you know what I'm saying, I remember one point where I had got like an eviction notice and everything, you know what I mean? Like I'm about to get evicted all my shit, man, I got Buku equipment, you know what I mean? And this is like the last day, you know what I mean? 
and money come through like the, like like I'm talking about on the last day. Laws pulling up and everything, you know what I mean? And I'm showing them that my things paid and everything, and they like cool, you know what I mean? Like that ain't really no failure, but it's like you know what I mean. You gonna have hurdles. They more like hurdles to me, like cause I don't, I don't consider consider myself anything that I've done in my life a failure. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't I don't I ain't even trying to allow that to happen. You know what I'm saying? Like that's 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 the point of making sure you you do the right business and you got the right things going on and you got the right circle of people around you. You know what I'm saying? Like like you you can't say that Dr. Dre had a failure. You know what I'm saying? Or something that that, that you know what I mean? He like he had hurdles. He had a whole lot of shit that was like you know what I mean? I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna let that be on. You know what I mean? But you gotta keep going, you gotta, you know what I mean, keep striving like you know you got your brain as long as you catch your peace of mind and you got your brain. Man, a, a nigga can't take shit from you, man. You know what I'm saying? So, as far as I'm concerned, I ain't, I ain't, I don't got no failures, you know what I'm saying? Like, we going this way, we going up, we going, you know what I'm saying? Straight up. What's up with your brother? Man, Wayne cracking, you know what I'm saying? He, they shooting a video shoot tomorrow. Shout out to Insane Wayne, big bro. You know what I mean? The new uh Shout Low single featuring Luda. You know what I'm saying? The ATL record, you know what I mean? They should produce that. Yeah, he produced that joint video tomorrow, so you know what I mean? They doing that thing, man. Checks coming in, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This your boy Drummer, man. You already know what's happening. D boy fresh, drum squad, you watching hip hop wide. You already know what time it is. You know what I'm saying? A town. Hey yeah. Boy.